Hi, today we're here at Synopsys to demonstrate the world's first USB 4 IP on the TSMC N6 process technology. USB 4 is the latest standard from the USB IF, offering blazing fast speeds of up to 40 gigabit per second, so you can transfer data from your computer to storage devices and peripherals such as your camera and phone. In addition to supporting data, USB 4 supports video and power, as well as other protocols such as DisplayPort, PCIe Express, and Thunderbolt through the Type-C cable and connector. USB 4 achieves 40 gigabit per second by running two lanes of 20 gigabit per second, each through USB Type-C cables and connectors. You can see the highlighted pins in the cable receptacle are assigned to one lane or the other. Okay, let's take a look at the demo. Here we have our evaluation board with the N6 test chip. Within this chip is our DesignWare USB 4 IP. The board includes an FPGA for configuration. The board is connected to the oscilloscope using standard cables and connectors. First, let's check out the transmitter signal. We have a demo GUI running on a Windows machine to configure and monitor the board. It has been set up for USB 4 Gen 3, but there are multiple options available for different configurations. Per channel, we can select the standard Pattern, Loopback Mode, Equalization Presetting, TX Enable Disable, RX Enable Disable, and the Receiver Lane. In this setup, we have one channel in Loopback and one with the TX connected to the oscilloscope. Once we're ready, we can go ahead and apply our configuration to the PHY. Now that the apply sequence is complete, we can look at the oscilloscope and see that we have a nice wide open eye running at 20 gigabit per second. The USB 4 spec also supports DisplayPort and of course earlier versions of USB. Here's a clear and wide open eye for DisplayPort, and here's another wide open eye for USB 3.0. Now we'll show the end-to-end -end demo by bringing in the RX signals as well. The demo includes the USB-C connector between the TX and RX ends. Within the demo GUI, we can configure the boards to transmit and receive from each other. Once done, we can look into one of the channels and check the receiver performance. One of the tools available is the internal RX scope. This is captured non-destructively. A bathtub tool is also available to get more accurate measurements of the eye height and width. You can see from these results that the link is running error-free. Thanks for joining me here today to see the world's first USB 4 IP running on 6 nanometer silicon. For more information, please visit us at synopsis.com/usb. Thank you.